I'm going to take one of my furnace molds, a uh, gravity mold, see if I can get it to make a nice ingot by using my oxygen acetylene torch. So I've got the two halves here, the ingot and the back. I can see right now I got a little borax in here. Borax works like glue in a mold. There we go. <coughs> and just put the two pieces together. And then the base clamp here just to groove and the tapers not quite as wide as the two mold have so it holds them together so it no force at all I mean you just set it in there put silver in top clamp works the same way. It just don't take much. The base has to be a little more stout so it doesn't break. But okay, I'm gonna get the torch and we'll see if I can get this to make an ingot by using a torch. They work beautiful in a furnace, so let me get the torch ready to go and I'll start this up again.
Well, we'll let the little Hummer cool. The silver dropped down in there. Why I use a propane furnace. I, I burn up enough oxygen and acetylene there. I could have, for the same value in propane, I could probably do four or five or more of these. It don't take long with two torches running in a six inch furnace to drop that. And when you get caddy at this, it, you don't have to let those molds get too cool to be able to put them back together again and get them ready to pour again. So we'll see what we get when it cools off a little bit. Now time to see. There was still borax in the silver. I don't know if I can get that to where you can see it or not. Oh yeah, made a nice little eagle beak. I'll go throw this in the pickle. But uh, you can use a torch to that's an oxygen acetylene torch or an air acetylene torch to do the gravity molds. Don't think you'd have much luck with air propane or air map. Uh, I've got this thing in the house. I just I didn't want to put it in the tumbler because that's about five hours. Uh, so I just hit this on the rag wheel and uh, it turned out pretty nice and if you can see below the eagle the last time I cast this and the ingot was stuck I knocked a chip out of the bottom of the mold it didn't leak out but it made an ugly spot but anyway it just shows that you can use the gravity mold with the torch with the oxygen acetylene torch that is so. turned out pretty nice okay well I'm done